to in it screen reader on Screen reader. The boy's mother is dead. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. The gods of these realms don't take kindly to outsiders, trust me. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. There's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. First, you need to cut off my head. 
Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. We can do whatever we want. There are consequences to killing a god! Mother. Back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. <laughs> No, 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 my boy! My dear sweet boy! It's Muller. Look, she was a giant. I'm a giant. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. The giants called me... Loki? A question for another day. Hungry? What's next? I'll get them ready. Need help? Oh, oh, oh. 
I hope Fenrir got some sleep. Maybe he'll be ready to eat when we get home. He is quite sick, Jess. I know, but he was a little better yesterday. Until he wasn't. If he keeps eating, I'm not giving up on him. Hear that? Yes. Is it hurt? It is hurt. The state is not far. Get ready! Falcon! Give up that easy. What she? She never does. Stay alert. There she is. Mother. Let go of him. Oh. Got you. You gotta get away from her. I'm trying. Up there. What she? Look out. The trees! They're coming down! That was too close. He's coming around again! Try that! I do not wish to fight you! I'm losing my grip here! Father! I have you! Hold tight! Protection stave is near. Oh no! Wait, we're not your enemy. Get away! Please don't make me do this. River Stave. We made it. Let us go home. It's Becky. It's Vana. Up. I'm sorry I couldn't take the shot. I did not wish you to. I keep hoping she'll let it go. You saved her life. I killed her son. There is no letting that go. Yeah. I guess killing Balder really did bring on Fimblewinter. It never stopped snowing after that day. Think it's ever gonna get better? Someday. But the worst is still ahead of us. We must be strong. I got it.
I don't hear him. He always says hello. Atreus. Fenrir. You okay, boy? It's okay, boy. You're okay. I know. I missed you, too. Where's your food? Still hungry? Come on, boy. You need to eat. Eat. What? Too big? There you go. Oh, boy. Atreus, the time draws near. You must prepare yourself. For what? He's still eating. He wants to live. He is dying. You're a good boy. A brave boy. Fast and strong. But you can rest now. Okay? I'll be okay. You can let go now. You have to let go. Sofna, Afra, Desu, Sofna, Hethon, Sofna, Sofna, Sofna. We train. What? No. It's the middle of the night. Night does not stop our enemies. Why? What for? Training is all we ever do. Ever. It's not enough. We can't hide forever. We do not hide. We prepare for a fight for which we are not ready. We'll go. Time is running out. The prophecies say Fimblewinter leads to Ragnarok. War is coming. Whatever Loki's supposed to be doing, he's supposed to be doing it now. My story doesn't end hiding in these woods. I should be out there, finding out who I am, who Loki is. I will not allow you to pick a fight with gods. I don't want to fight anyone. I just want answers. And if those answers lead to war with Asgard? Maybe that's what Mother wanted. We do not know what Mother wanted. Looks like we never will.
Look. Can I have a moment alone with Fenrir before I bury him? Well, I don't recognize that dour expression anywhere. Care to tell me what went wrong? The wolf is gone. Oh, no. Not Fenrir. How's the lad taking it? Not well. He goes to bury him. Oh, damn it. All right, brother. Good night, then. Kratos? Are you joining me? Very. Are you ready? You walk as though Emir himself sits atop your shoulders. This is your hunt. I will follow. Very well, Grumbles. Fresh kill. At least it didn't suffer. Hmm. Am I to decipher your grunting? Tell me your thoughts. We hunt a predator. A wolf. Yes. Predators kill. It is the natural order of things. Your words are misguided. Shh, shh, shh. Approach slowly. It's okay, little one. We want to help. Don't we? No, don't! <sighs> Come on. The sick wolf we found beyond our stave. He found his way inside. As I said he would. We should have acted. It was not our concern. Now it is. A problem doesn't have to reach our doorstep for it to be our responsibility. If we have the power to limit the harm it could cause, we should act. Who are we to hide and do nothing? We are not hiding.
Gonna make me pick that one up. Mm. Good boy. This way. Very. Atreus. Hence my bellowing. He never came back from burying the wolf. It's been some time. It cannot be far. Baldur's chasm is too unstable, brother. The lad wouldn't try it. You don't suppose he was training in the middle of the night? I suggested as much. Did you? What on earth for? He was grieving. Oh, Kratos, I know you're trying. Let's see. Tracks heading down to the frozen river. That's most likely where he did the burying. Fire's dwindling now. Where else could he have gone from here? He crawled through here. You seem troubled in your sleep, even for you. Nightmares? I dream of the past. 
almost every night. Ah, the bad old days in Greece? No, it feels like Faye is trying to tell me something. You don't mean to say you're talking to ghosts again, brother? No, but it is something more than memory. <laughs> Use your words, brother. The tracks stop here. Out, Nerman! And we're not alone. should check on the protection, Steve. There's a tree up ahead, yeah? Well? You were right. The stave is broken. Explains our trespassers. What happened here? A bear. Mauled. By what? A larger bear. Wounded. The fight destroyed the tree. We must find Atreus. Aye. Between the savage beasts and marauding raiders, he may have sought shelter. Follow the trail. We'll find him. a way around. Aha! Trail's on the other side of that gap, if you can clear the way. We won't find him this way. <laughs> Let's find that trail of blood. idea what could have made the lad wander off. We argued. He accuses me of hiding from Odin. Eh, only sensible to keep a low profile after killing three of his kin. A reckoning will come. That is why Atreus must learn to survive on his own. Oh, this is about that prophecy. Just because the giants had you dead on some wall full of otherwise accurate predictions. I do not believe in prophecies. Well, Good. Mamir. 
I'm skeptical by nature, though we have seen things that defy explanation. So, speaking as the smartest man alive, I've no bloody idea. Where's that trail gone? We'll have to go around, pick up the trail on the other side. Atreus can handle himself. You've taught him well. So he keeps telling me. into that cave. Well, we know where we are going. I'm sure we can find a quiet way in. <laughs> or you could do that. Raiders you rescued the wolves from? No. They have not been here long.
The trail goes through here. Leads deeper in. There will be more. Someone got in the bear's way. That one's got a sling. Look out, brother. Atreus, are you here? Huh. Well, that's for the best. Let's find a way out. The trail leads back out. We need our own way up to find it again. Perhaps Atreus came here seeking shelter, kept moving when he saw the raiders, and the bear came barreling after. Impressive rampage, I'll give it that. You think the bear was chasing Atreus? Well, just as likely the bear was hurt and Atreus was chasing him to help. You know the lad. Well, 
We found the bear, or he found us. Here it comes! Prayed Fenrir, and then I'm, I'm not sure. I was so sad, and then I was angry and scared. I remember running. There was a bear. Charging and I charged back. That had to be a dream. Your emotions, they transformed you. Uh, I, I, I didn't know I could do that. Of your abilities. And we will be 
dangerous without discipline to control them. You've already taught me discipline. I need more than that. I need answers. Answers you don't have. Answers only your mother had. That's how she withheld. What if there was someone who could help us? Someone that could give us answers about the giants and who Loki's supposed to be? Atreus. Wouldn't that help to understand what I'm becoming? Atreus! Listen to me. I might have killed you. Until you learn control, we will take no unnecessary risks. Inaction is also a risk. You taught me that. Stop thinking like a father for a moment and start thinking like a general. No! This way. So, are we going to discuss the boy becoming a bear? Yeah. Are we? Not now. We need to repair the protection stave and get home. What happened to the protection stave? You did. So you're blaming me? I am not blaming you, Atreus. Well, tell your voice that. Besides your gift of language and hearing creatures' thoughts, are there any other new magical abilities to report? Not really. What of Fenrir? What about him? When he died, you cast a spell. No, I didn't. But I saw light. I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm. Trick of Fimble Winter, perhaps. Seen my share. With all the blood. Yours, Atreus. Seriously? That, or any prey you might have been dragging, I suppose. Not sure that makes me feel any better.
this one. What? What can we do? Nothing. Nature will take its course. Old enough. We are almost home. Wow, a lot of those guys. It's been like this all night. They must have been inside the stave when I fixed it. Sometimes I really wish Tyr's temple still worked so we could get out of Midgard. They say Fimblewinter affects all realms, lad. Okay, but how could things be any worse than here? Hey, Svana, you're not scared. You're a brave girl. Good. Brave girl. That's right. He's good with them. No surprise, really. Specky, you okay? Just a little thunder. That's a good girl. Good girl. Atreus! I'm just checking on... To bed! Yes, sir.
As evenings go, that was entirely too eventful. Though I admit it was a bit like old times there, for a moment. The three of us navigating some hitherto unhappened upon patch of forest. Been a while since you've joined us. If that's what you mean. Ah, well, just tired, I suppose. You've seen one deer hunt, you've seen them all. How can you feel tired when you never sleep? There are other kinds of tired, lad. You'll see when you're older. You do intend to get some sleep tonight, yeah? We do. Good night, Mumir. Now have a proper rest, my brothers. Things are always brighter in the morning. The ball. Come in. I have meat. You would not find me good company. No. I'm sure we'll find lots to talk about. You could have told me before I poured. Why are you here? Uh, just uh, being polite. You seem like a calm and reasonable person. Say the moment calls for calm. <laughs> yeah.
You know who I am? Back before winter set in, there were some misunderstandings. Regrettable ones. But I think we all have a better idea of who we're dealing with. Now, what you did to his boys. Self-defense. Dying is what we Aesir live for. And let's be honest, they were kind of useless. But Balder, he had value. He was my best tracker, my closer. Yeah, his mind was gone, sure. But he had his uses, and now he's gone because of you. You follow me? You have a debt. You're no fun anymore. What do you want? How about peace? How does peace strike the esteemed, retired god of war? How about we just don't kill each other? How about you stay home, kick up your feet, seek no quarrel with me, and I'll have none with you. Of course, it means that that one, that one has to stop his search for tear. Yeah, we know what you've been up to. Stop it. Tears old ways are dead. He is dead. You understand? And then that's it. Then we're square. Shit, I'll even sweeten the deal. I'll let you keep the prisoner that I know you stole. <laughs> that's right. I know you're in here somewhere, you silver-tongued little shit. Why should we believe a word of you? What of your promises ever been worth? There he is, my old partner in crime. He's lost weight. If he tells you snow is white, he's lying. What kind of wisdom is that? Can't the smartest head alive see past himself? See that we all want the same thing? All right. Here's a deal I know you can trust. I'll settle your debt with my ex. Keep Freya off your back. Keep your boy safe. That's really all you want, isn't it? So what do you say? Don't take all day. Seek that fight with your brother. <laughs> I don't care. That's all? You were finally showing. Can't fight without your axe, coward. You 
know my task? The ghost uh. of Sparta thing? Yeah. Then you know what I'm capable of. Show me! Now we got us a fight! How were you ever a god of war? You're starting to piss me off. Look at you, trying to remember your old moves. You insult me holding back like this. Was hoping to see your blade. Guess they don't come when you call. Stop holding back! That's for Magni! Sorry about your statue, Tear, you preachy old stiff. If you're not fighting dirty, you're not fighting, right? Your son struck first! Good! Let me see the monster inside! That ain't how it works. You're a destroyer, like me. Oh no. I say when we're done. I'm not leaving till I see the real you. Get up! You should be better than this! Because they hurt his feelings. This is for Moody. You put him last, even in death. The fuck you say? Moody saw us in fear of you. He died of the wounds you gave him! Oh, we got a model father here! This feels familiar. What? Don't matter. 
I can give a hot shit about your fatherly advice. I want to see the god of war. Who started this? I will end it! Sons fell to you. Even this lesser version of you. But I am not my sons. And your boy, all father, has plans for him. No! Consider your blood debt paid. Be seeing you. Told you he'd make it. Kratos, it's Sindri and Brock. That was quite a fight. Can we? Boom! Now, Odin is with Atreus. Oh no! I'll go get a gateway ready. Come on then. Ain't a long walk. Go! Let's check on Atreus. Well, good to see you making new friends. Ain't that me old near pack of punch? You know we made that hammer, right? You have mentioned it. I know that. Wasn't ever sure you were listening. Least it was good to see the axe hold her own. Kind of the point, after all. This will get you home. No use trying to bifrost your way around the realms. Odin's got him locked down tight. Or ain't you noticed? Hey, one last thing there, Tiny. If you got Aesir at your door, then I reckon your protection staves busted. Once you chase Odin off, you got another place to lay your head tonight? And I don't mean that talking, fella. I will not abandon my home. 
Oh, yeah? And what's to stop the all fucker from spying on you? Or Raven pecking your house to splinters while you're asleep in it? Nothing, that's what. You go get your boy, and I'll speak to a certain someone about putting you up at his place in a pinch. I was about to look for you. Are you hurt? Are you? What does he want? To uh, pay for the roof. And he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I told him no, obviously. Good. Why were you searching for Tyr? If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth from me? I wanted to tell you. I really did, but now that you know, there's something you should see. No. Just trust me, you'll want to. Trust! You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our backs. And I think I know how. Sir. So we gather your things.
Are you ready? Go. And keep the change, you bastard! Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. Did Odin say anything else while you were outside? Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. You think he knows all the Giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? What happened here? So close to home. Our raiders warring with one another now. Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. More over here. And fresh. Did they all get in while the stave was down? That, or Odin cocked up the protection spell altogether. What do you see? Hmm. Just animal tracks. <laughs> Almost to the bridge. <clears throat> oh, guess the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. <sighs> dreams. Hey, try using your blades to pull this down. Please. Whoa, that one's still alive. No, look closer. Ah, hell raiders now? Who's doing this? Suppose it's too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours. Yeah, probably. Whoa! Could have warned me! Seriously, who'd be stringing up raiders like that? You see something down there? Hell, brother, what was that? Something strong and dangerous. Be on guard. Oh, yeah, being all the way on guard. There's the temple now. Just need to find a way around. Oh, 
this bridge collapse? Oh, a while ago. Wasn't me. Whatever it is, it works <laughs> fast. <laughs> Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the Giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead? Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. Right? He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the Giant's greatest ally. So... Enough. Still putting up offering soda. I don't think he cares. Pillar wasn't in the way last time I came. Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the Giants, so he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. What do you know? You'll see soon. Imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Many dead here. We should keep moving. It's too late. 
Father, use your blade. Burn them. Later on the left. Nicely done. Right side, incoming! Fire! Behind you! Isn't it nice how Fimblewind had wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. <laughs> 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 Got it. Wonder who they mean. Isn't it nice how Fimblewind had wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. Nasty hit! You all right, brother? Isn't it nice how Fimblewind had wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. <laughs> Oh! 
fly. On it. Ah, he has gotten rather good at that. Yet another grizzly seed. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Oh no! Brother! Father! A stalker! On your guard, brother! I think we found our predator! Your shield's busted, brother! Just keep your feet moving, yeah? Winter Freya, the raiders throwing Odin barging in, and now stalkers praying in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Father, the shield Mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now... Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps. Later. Come on, we can get in this way. Hmm. <laughs> 
here, Atreus. Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we really <laughs> How do you always know how to find those? Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. Ah, things collapsing on a regular basis in these parts. Thimble winter wears down all things. Even stone. Give over on the right. There we go. Come on. Watching? Well, that's new. <sighs> Come on. Atreus, wait. Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati, the wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. 
And then the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse? I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait! I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No. I found it in one of the other shrines. Other oh, shrines? Right. How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned, but I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. They mention black smoke and the bleeding earth. But we can never figure out exactly... We? Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. It, it wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding earth? Sounds like a mine, eye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartal, fine. That's a good bet. Their minds did belch black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it, then. Tears and Svartal find somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So? What now? Home. This way. Lad, even if we consider looking for Tyr, how do you have us getting to Svartalfine? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. <laughs> Looks kind of cracked there. There's a shortcut this way. What's under there, you think? 
Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. <sighs> we must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. Ah, back to smashing through things for fun and profit. Lovely! Maria, what did you hear of Odin's offer? To the lad? Not much. They stepped outside. But he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? Almost home. Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. If we could find a way to open Rome travel to Spartafon, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to... Enough. We will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search for good. All right. You won't be sorry. and breed is that atreus it's been so long <gasps> how you've grown <laughs> uh oh well, yeah <sighs> well if you'll follow me brock mentioned he needed somewhere safe to spend the night and i believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that we're still your favorite dwarves right you're still the only dwarves we know i'll take it Brother, I think we both know it's not safe here. Hate to say it, but we should talk to Sindri.
after you, my friends. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <clears throat> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, we've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimblewinter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, it, actually. Intriguing. Right this way, Kratos. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Svarto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's... What? It it's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son in disobeying me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. N nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. Oh. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so fast. How'd that get in here? Who in the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. I blame you. Now, well, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits, at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey, I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivanting. You know this. Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, 
Best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Hmm. Looks like Thimble Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's overdue for some Brock love. Some items you left behind, tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around, check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. <laughs> Thank you. This place is great, Sindri. You built it all yourself? You know it. What'll it be? Need something special? No refunds.
And how's life been treating everyone's favourite as your Vulgarian? The fuck you call me? <laughs> Exquisite. Wait! Those stairs will not support you. Please don't break my house. See? I knew you wanted a snack. Hey, come see. I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Finding everything all right, I hope? How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours. Sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you? You just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. I've always wanted to see your home realm. Svartalfheim sounds unique. Svartalfheim? <laughs> Stupid Aesir name. We look like dark elves to you. Oh, right. You call the realm something else. Nidavellir, which is also the name of the capital city and where you should look for Durlin. Damn city so full of Odin fuckers nowadays. It ain't hardly somewhere a self-respecting dwarf would show his face. Harsh, but accurate.
You hear that? Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. What are you doing? I don't think they're a threat. Also, aren't you way out of range? We'll just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock? Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, I uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh! Oh, Cindy, a sodding bastard! <laughs> Open! Open, now! I, I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it! <laughs> oh! That's it! That's it! Good! Now, release! Still unpleasant! Oh, that's our cue! Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Frostle got eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just need to adjust. <gasps> there! That should do it. <sighs> see? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Kratos! Throw me at him! Horns first! <laughs> In case you take a joke, you old goat! <laughs> Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. That's Midgard in the middle. I know you're not going back there anytime soon. To get to any of those realms, you'll need a seed for them. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! You do remember we don't have the Unity Stone to let us jump off, right? Of course he remembers. Right, brother? Of course I remember.
Whoa, do you feel that? What's that, lad? Anything, everything. It's warm. We can probably use this boat, if I can just get it free. Careful, lad. <gasps> One less feathery spy. Ah! Why are these things so fast? <laughs> already off to a lively stop. Petraeus, you dropped your bug. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. <laughs> What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said fairy appears to be missing. Huh. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here, against Odin, and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have come that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. Did you see that over there?
That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? It's pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. If only we were in Midgard, that water would be frozen in a second. Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Freyd Mars Brassard, father of a few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Brock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. That's dirty enough to climb? Aye. Good old dwarven craftsmanship. <gasps> Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. Ugh. <sighs> 
Okay, there's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. Whoa! Whoa there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartal Farm? Aye, lad. Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that. Fimble winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Think we can fit under that bridge? Father, up there. <laughs> 
Find anything good up there? Those geysers? Hmm. <clears throat> hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? <laughs> yes! The wheel's moving and the gate's coming down. That's dwarven ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned.
Ms. Atreus, do you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war? I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Yikes, this place is wrecked. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Good thing you learned the runes, brother.
I think that's everything here. Want to get going? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to neither Valir. Too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. See what it drops. You can uncover that geyser from here. Turn the wheel.
blocks coming down. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. Something else we can hit? <laughs> Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. There's still the other chain to pull. How are we going to get to it? Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Nice one. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Can you see anything from that block? That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Exactly, are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. earthquake earlier. You think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus. Look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. Alarm. 
only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Talk to we you don't for want any trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in.